Something that's super important for the front side slappy is your foot positioning. And uh, some people think it's a good idea to have your foot way up on the nose over the, actually on top of the truck. But it's been my experience, that's a, not a good idea. It usually doesn't work out well, and I'll explain why in a second. But for me, I like to have my front foot just behind the bolts, a little bit of an angle like that. And you can see I like to have my heel hanging off because a lot of this trick comes from your heels and your hips and your shoulders. So um, the more you have your heel over, the easier the trick kind of ends up being. And my foot on the tail, I like to have it something like that, similar. See, I got my toes to the edge and I got my heel hanging off. So foot position going in at the curb is something like this. All right, so when you come at this thing, you want to come at it something like this with our foot position like we talked about, our toes on, even over a little bit, our heel hanging off, and our foot with our toe right at the edge and heel hanging off. And what you're trying to do is you're trying to lean back as you approach this curb, and you're trying to time it as such to where your front wheel hits and simultaneously you swing your back hip of your back leg in at the curb. That's where you get the slap. And once you get up there, if you kind of sit on your heels a little bit, you'll grind in the pinch on your heel side here, on your toe side in the front. And when you're ready to come off, you just turn your shoulders front side and you'll come right off. So that's the thing to it. What I'd mentioned before about having your front foot too far up on top of the truck is what'll happen is when your truck hits, even if it's kind of a slippery curb, um, when your truck hits and your front foot is too far forward, you'll stop. It'll, it's so much resistance that it throws you forward really easily and then you just get pitched off the trick. Or sometimes what'll happen is if you do get up, you have so much weight on the front that the board just comes right off. So it's, it doesn't even work. It's just easier to get a longer of a gliding grind if you have your truck, uh, or rather your foot behind the truck a tiny bit and your heels off. And again, like I said, you're getting your, your ump for this trick from your heels. So it's lean back on your heels, swing your hip, which makes it easier because you have your heel hanging off the tail to get into the grind. And uh, that's how it works.